Good afternoon, welcome back. It really is Wednesday, and it is October 18th, 2023. Yesterday we stated it was Wednesday when it was really Tuesday in disguise. Um, but it is Wednesday. Uh, we only have a couple birthdays and a couple of events to talk about. <clears throat> We're going to go in the Wayback Machine here to 1959. Lee Petty wins at North Wilkesboro for his 11th and final win of the season. And this basically ties up, sews up for him, the uh, Grand National Championship for that year, which would be his third and final NASCAR championship. We're going to fast forward now to 2015 at Kansas in the Cup Series. Joey Logano wins that race after late race contact with Matt Kenseth. We all know how that ended a few races later at Martinsville, which we'll probably be talking about here in a couple weeks on the show. But I just did want you to know that between 1970 and 2015, 1970 there was a Cup race at Martinsville that Richard Petty won. Not really anything significant out of that, but from... Um, 1970 to 2015, there were no cup races on this date. So that's a pretty big window of NASCAR history that uh, did not happen on this date. And again, we're in the fall, uh, a lot of breaks in the schedule, and it could just be the calendar anomaly that we speak of. So two birthdays today, born on this day in 1973, Former IndyCar driver, but now he races in that Canadian NASCAR Tour. What is it, the the Pinty Series or the... I can't remember what they call it now, but it's the NASCAR Canadian Series. And that'd be Alex Tagliani. Of course, he's uh, raced, like I say, in the Champ Car IndyCar world for a long time. Then he made the move to the NASCAR Series north of the border and has had some pretty good success there. He has run a few Xfinity Series races uh, on the road courses for different teams. He hasn't won, but I think with the right circumstances, a little bit of luck on his side, he could have pulled off a victory. And then uh, our second birthday, born on the state in 1924, and sadly passed away in 1958. He is the uncle of a birthday boy from yesterday. And he has a brother that obviously is the father of the birthday boy that also raced in NASCAR. And that would be Billy Myers. Of course, Billy's brother is Bobby Myers. His nephew is Chocolate Myers. So there's a little bit of info about Billy. A little bit of NASCAR stats there. And there's some of his uh, achievements. Of course, the Myers Brothers Memorial Award is named after him and his brother. <clears throat> and then there is an early checkered flag, Bowman Gray. So a little bit there about the front of the card. So anyway, that, again, going to be a short video today, just how these happen. Um, I'm sure you guys don't mind it because uh, you get a little bit of uh, mental nourishment. And you can go about the rest of your day. So anyway, thanks again for watching. Really, really do appreciate it. We will see you tomorrow.